well, well, well. I was watching the internet today and uh, I got a pleasant surprise. I came across this video where this guy was talking about, he wanted to talk about something that no one was talking about. And I was like, as soon as I saw the video, I was like, I bet you I'm talking about it. And he's talking about people are starting to realize that they need to make more money. And what do I mean by realization? There's always been how to make more money, these tactics, these quick, these easy, these simple ways to make a lot of money. I think a lot of people have tried that and they've come to the realization that it doesn't work. And I feel that people are ready to do what they need to do to start making money. I've got a video on the corporate game talking about how to make a lot of money over the long term. Check it out. And what I am seeing is a change in the culture, a change in people. Now there's always going to be a certain group of people who are going to go for the get rich quick screams are going to try to cheat the system, but I feel that more and more people are being pushed to that position where they're going to do what they have to do to make more money. I feel that during all this pandemic, all of this change, all of this stuff that's going on, that people are at a point where they're going to do what they need to do to start something to make some money because I'm noticed something and this is funny. I actually watch a lot of YouTube ads because I plan on running some ads and I'm just seeing what's working. And I've noticed that the majority of ads that I used to see running last year are not running anymore. I am seeing a select few. There's a guy and his daughter. Like I taught my daughter how to make X amount of money using Google Maps. That video still plays. But there's one video I have not seen. It was the video where people were like opening up these envelopes and pulling out all this cash and checks. I have not seen that video. I have not seen. There's a lot of advertising I have not seen because. I, you know, part of me wanted to spend some money on the program just to see what it's about, just to deconstruct it. I may do that in the future. But one of the things that I consistently see is that a lot of programs have literally stopped running apps. There's this guy, Jeff Baxter, the guy with the little fro. He's running his ads. And I feel that a lot of people have tried these things and they figured out that they don't work. And they're like, and I don't think they just tried one thing. I think they've tried several different things and they've come to the realization it doesn't work. And I feel that this is setting the stage for people to do what they need to do from a responsible, from a uh, situation of doing the right work. And what do I mean by that? How many times have I said, Hey guys, you're going to start a business. You're looking at three to five years of hard work before your business gets to that point where you can relax and where you can hire people and you can stay, you know, that, that I, I've been saying that I've been consistently saying that and I've been the only one on YouTube who has consistently and clearly stated that. And I've been saying that for years because uh, one of the things that's happening with home economics, um, <laughs> Uh, there's a, there's a part in there about something that recently happened on YouTube. Go ahead and enroll in home economics and get the course. And, uh, it, it is crazy how these tried and true economic principles don't change. They just don't change. And I am seeing a lot of stuff and I feel that as we get into 2022, that toward the end of 2022, as we get into 2023, 
I fully expect the recession to be roaring in 2023. I fully expect the housing crash correction to happen in 2023. I fully expect a lot of people to be um, really, really um, struggling. And I, I get this from a lot of you guys. Say, Glendon, if everyone's going to be broke, who's going to afford to buy your courses? My dear people, thank you for worrying about me, but you don't have to worry. Because see, I understand something that you don't. Regardless of how bad it gets, there's always a group of people who have money and will spend that money on the things they want. Always. I don't care. Great Depression, worst economic cycle we've ever had in the United States. 25% unemployment, which meant that 75% of the people had jobs, which meant that 75% of the people were buying tires, butter, eggs, milk. You, you get what I'm saying. Uh, once again, during the Great Depression, pulp fiction writers became millionaires. And I want you to think, how many books you have to sell at a nickel to become a millionaire? I don't have my calculator, but that's, I mean, that's 20 books to make a dollar. So it's 200 books to make $10. It's 2,000 books to make $1,000. 200,000 books to make 2,000, I think. So we're selling, we're talking about millions and millions of books being sold to make these guys millionaires a nickel at a time. So I am very much encouraged. This is the day that I'm doing a lot of uh, office work and I'm correcting stuff and I'm emailing people. But I just thought, and this is probably gonna be one of the shortest videos of the year. Uh, Cause like I said, um, I think that people are ready to do the proper things to make money because they've been teased They've been played with, they've been scammed, they've been conned, they've been manipulated. And I feel, you know, once again, for those of you who worry about my, my finances, uh, don't, don't. I am very good at making money during bad times. I am really, really good at that. So don't even worry about me. I'll be fine. Uh, what, you, what you need to do is worry about yourself, worry about your house, we're about your money. And this is one of the reasons that I'm putting together the home economics course, which it looks like I should get it finished this week. Maybe because there's something else that's brewing. Uh, one of the things that like uh, the webinars, there will be a webinar this Sunday at 4 p.m. talking about the resale business. And next Sunday, there will be a webinar talking about how to fix your credit. And then we start to go into the new thing in the middle of April. So we're about getting ready to cook with some gas because uh, right now I got a lot of stuff cooking. Uh, I have emailed a lot of people today and working on a lot of stuff. So, um, yeah. I feel that people are finally understanding that they need to make money. Because once again, let's be 100% clear. They knew and they wanted, they knew and they desired to make more money. That was always there. But I think the going from the scammy approach, going from the approach where people are just, um, I feel that it's coming to an end. I feel that people are starting to become more realistic. That's one of the things that I think is happening. So I just wanted to put this out here. Let me know your thoughts and opinions. And you can go ahead and enroll in home economics because I'm telling you there's something else that's coming. And everyone that enrolls in econo home economics is going to get a $500 discount off of the next thing, which will be a completely standalone platform. So you want to go ahead and enroll in home economics right now. Links below. And I'll see you guys in the next one.